again Don Juan, as he had done nearly every day for nearly a week, held me spellbound with his knowledge of specific details about the behavior of game. By the end of the day, he had caught five quail in a most ingenious trap, which he had taught me to assemble and set up. He said two were enough for us and let three of them loose. After we finished eating, we walked very leisurely toward a rocky area. We sat on a sandstone hill and I said jokingly that if he would have left the matter up to me, I would have cooked all five quail and that my barbecue would have tasted much better than his roast. No doubt. But if you would have done all that, we might have never left this place in one piece. What do you mean? I asked. What would have prevented us? The shrubs, the quail, everything around would have pitched in. I never know when you're talking seriously, I said. He made a gesture of feign and patience and smacked his lips. You have a weird notion of what it means to talk seriously. I laugh a great deal because I like to laugh, yet everything I say is deadly serious, even if you don't understand it. Why should the world be only the way you think it is? Who gave you the authority to say so? There's no proof. The world is otherwise, I said. 